Hi everyone, happy Wednesday. I'm Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with 2020 Topps Chrome Update Baseball Sapphire Edition. A lot of layers there. Four box, random team break number one. As you can see right there, one spot gets you two teams in this uh, four box break. One auto per box, a lot of nice stuff here. So let's take you guys right here and let's uh, double up. Uh, uh. Like Sir Mix-a-Lot, all 30 teams are in. Let's roll it, let's rando it. Two and a three, five times for names and teams. One, two, three, four, and five. We got Jonathan down to Nick. Two and a three, five times for the teams. One, two, three, four. And fifth and final time. After five, we got the Marlins down to the Chicago White Sox. All right, so here's how the randomizer shakes out for all of you. Jonathan with the Marlins. Jason with my rivals, the Giants. Nick with the O's. Wade with the Nationals. Chris with the Rockies. David with the Indians. Brandon with the Red Sox and the Yankees. Jeremy with the Astros. Peter with the Cubbies. Emma, you got my Dodgers. Jason with the Reds, Jonathan with the Diamondbacks, Juan with the Twins, Peter with the Phillies, Jarrell with the Brew Crew, Adam with the Angels, Jarrell with the Pirates, Chris with the Tampa Bay Rays, Emma with the Blue Jays, Juan with the Tigers, Wade with the A's, David with the Mariners, Jonathan with the Royals, John, Padres, Jonathan, Braves, Adam, Cardinals, John with the Rangers, Jeremy Port with the Mets, Nick Coba with the Chicago White Sox. All right, so let's put all this on one page here. Sort by column B. Let's, uh, we're going to pause the video and allow a little bit of uh, trading time. We're going to dig up a checklist for you, too. I'm going to go grab the boxes as well. So stick around. We'll be right back. All right. Welcome back, folks. There was a lot of trade chatter, but the deal did just not did not get done here on the third. Four box, random team number one. It's all good. We've got another four boxes in the store. I think a few more breaks to run after that as well, judging from what I saw in the back. I think that's all for me. And not for not for Instagram. Maybe it's somewhere for Instagram. So there's the three box right here and the fourth right here. Good luck, ladies and gentlemen. All card ship, right? Yes, all card ship. And the next break is already in single digits. The 15 spot break is already at nine. Couple boxes. We'll go two at a time. Do you remember the time? Oh, autographs. I think there's one auto a box. Eight packs per box. Four cards per pack. There should be an auto per box. If you want to look at the odds, there they are right there. It's not like super tiny, so I can sh actually show it to you. We're inching closer and closer to the baseball season, folks, which is exciting. I, think, I don't know what the latest is. Spring training is supposed to be on time, but the season might not start on time. There may be fewer games, more double headers, a DH. I don't know what the latest proposal or counter proposal has been, but either way, it looks like we're going to get some baseball this season. Ray can't believe Arenado got traded. Well, I think that's been kind of in the works for a while. Last year, Arenado and the Cardinals were were kind of uh, kind of in talks, but it just never worked out. So the so the smoke was there. That finally happened this this year. I, I I can't believe they sent that much money to the Cardinals. I mean, I know they're saving money on the on the Arenado by not paying Arenado for the rest of his years, but still $50 million to make Arenado go away, basically. I mean, it's a lot. I guess just, I guess just didn't work, just didn't work out. I think he expected a lot of, I mean, I think him and, and, and Rockies fans expected ownership to do a lot of things to build around Arenado. And I think it just didn't happen.
All right, we've got green Ichiro. Nice. 43 out of 45. It's a pretty nice one for the Mariners, David Duffy. Well, that's what I was saying yesterday, Ray, is that if you're going to move Arenado, then move everybody. Trade everyone. You know, trade Charlie Blackman. Trade Trevor Story. Get, get rid of all of them. So, nice one. David Duffy. I love that atomic background that they have here. It's pretty sharp. Got Randy Arozarena, who played some good ball last year in the playoffs. And our autograph is a nice one. Nick Solak for the Texas Rangers. That's John Deneen. Last spot mojo strikes again 60% of the time. Last spot mojo hits 100% of the time. It's truth. It's supposed to be pretty good. We got some orange coming up here, and it's orange. Chris Martin, eleven out of twenty-five. Orange Chris Martin. I didn't know that the uh, the front man for Coldplay was playing a little American baseball here. That goes to Jonathan and the ATL. And for the Giants, Maurizio Dubon. That goes to Jason and the Giants. Got a nice Mike Trout right here, too. I heard of this guy. This guy's pretty good. That'll go to the Angels. That'll be for Adam. All right, next two boxes... And we got another four box break in the store right now, jazbeescasebreaks.com. Adam's saying, kid I went to high school with got drafted by the Rockies in the third round last year. He recently got traded to the Red Sox. Pretty cool to come back home. That is pretty cool. I wonder if that's a hassle or not. Some players say it's a hassle. Some players say, like, if people are hitting you up for tickets and. Friends that aren't really your friends coming out of the woodwork. But I guess if you could play in front of your like family, that'd be pretty cool. Uh, Red Sox fans, take care of uh, take care of Alex Verdugo and now Kike Hernandez. You guys are gonna love Kike. Guy, guy can play almost every position. Is clutch. Great leader in the clubhouse. You know, pretty good follow on social media, but yeah, Kike Hernandez is going to be a lot of is going to be a lot of fun, is, and he gets a chance to play every day. So hopefully that will uh, that will really show the world what he can he can do. I don't think he was going to quite get that playing time in in, uh, in LA. So LA is just has the luxury of too much depth, but he really should have a chance to play every day. two boxes again we've got more in the store but we do not have an unlimited supply so i would get into this early and often before we run out we might blink and be like oh there we go i guess that's it so don't miss out this stuff is really great the resale value on this is pretty strong too that's why we're we're sending everything here is that numbered no i think that's just the background that's definitely numbered. That's Sean Poppin. 23 out of 25. Poppin for Wade in Washington. 
Remember, uh, remember Todd Van Poppel? I remember there's popping right there though. No, no relation, obviously. And behind Kirsch is ooh, nice an Anthony Rendon autograph. There you go. Tip, tip your bartenders. There's Ryan Harold. And that'll be for Adam and the Angels. There you go. In the arms of the angels. There's a Luis Robert for Nick Kova and the Chicago White Sox. All right, and the final stack here. Remember, all cards ship, so... We'll be get, hopefully everyone will be getting something. 45 out of 45, Tommy Pham. There you go, Pham. That goes to John and the Friars. Kind of reconstructed that starting rotation, which should be should be interesting to see as a Dodgers fan. There's Brock Holt, and behind Brock Holt is Shun Yamaguchi. Rookie autograph for the Toronto Blue Jays. That'll be for... Emma, there you go, Emma. Emma Ward. And the Bluebirds. It's Joe Kelly. And Julio Tehran and Josh Fuentes right here. And there you go, ladies and gentlemen. That's it. That was 2020 Tops Chrome Update Baseball Sapphire Edition Random Team number one. There you go, boys and girls. Not too shabby at all. All card ship, but these were some of the some of the highlights here. Thanks for watching. Thanks for breaking. I'm Joe. I'll see you next time for the next break. Bye bye.